love breakfast at the Dumpy Brown. Daily feast of luxury and sophistication. You don't have to be here. But if I wasn't, I'd miss all the fun. Oh, oh. sorry, Justine. It's called Becky. It's Rebecca. Whatever. On the edge, Crash. Go on, Crash. OK, everyone. Who wants to come outside and meet the new arrivals, eh? Meet our new it, residents. Wow, it's a really cute. No. Hey, Justine, he's got your nose. Yeah, but he's got your bum ribs. <laughs> <laughs> What's his name? He hasn't got one. We can call him West Ham. <laughs> West Ham. You get it? Wow. I found an egg, I found an egg. Mike, whatever's going on? Well, Duke has already given us a fabulous vegetable patch. I thought I'd take it one step further. <laughs> We're going to have fresh eggs for tea. And bacon. <laughs> you might have told me. Well, they can't stay here. They're going to ruin my open day. So, what open day? The one I organised as head care worker. A, a, a temporary head care worker. Thanks a lot for telling me. Well, I'm sorry, but I forgot. Anyway, it's going to be very low-key, so I just need everybody to help me set everything up. After all, Mike, children in care need foster parents, and foster parents need to know that children in care are just... Well, ordinary children. Now, who's going to help? All clear. We are doing the right thing, aren't we? It does look kind of sad. Yeah. How would you like being cooped up? I wouldn't. Betty misses his family, too. Yeah. He hasn't even got any mud to roll in. Ready to set him free? Ready. Free Piggy! Biscuits, mate. Oi, oi, oi. Biscuits? I hope. Not bad. Thanks. For once. Can we help, Mike? Oh, thanks. Go on, then. Just, look, just stir that for me, will you, while I uh, find the book. Glad to be of assistance. What are you up to? Well, Leo, sugary biscuits so bad for your teeth, put salt in instead. But then they'll taste horrible. Exactly. But what if some nice people turn up? Get real. But if they did, we could leave you and have a real family. Like Chantel. It's just you and me now. Got it? Yeah. I got it. Good. We're going to make this an open day they'll never forget. seen Duke's cookbook? Second gate on the left. <laughs> Ow! Shouldn't he be outside with all the other ones? No, he's a guard chicken. Oh, guard chicken. Right, one hour and counting. Plenty of time for us to smarten ourselves up. Which one do you think, Mike? Well, uh, uh, the green one would go lovely with your eyeshadow. It's for you, silly. Elaine, people aren't going to want to see Mike in a tie and us all poshed up. I want to see what fostering is really like. Just chill out, will you? And I suppose you're the expert, are you? Compared to you, pea brain, anyone is. Uh, uh, right, right, right now, we have got no time for this today. Now, why don't you two just make yourselves useful for a change and help me set up an information desk? Information, information desk? Oh, just do it! <laughs> What 
are you doing? Come on, Roxy. This is our chance for something. Somewhere better. No one's gonna foster you because you're wearing your best shirt. It's just you and me now. Well, hard double triple. Close door, close door, close door. That was close. Now what do we do? Walk him. Pigs are really clean animals. Cleaner than some of the kids around here anyway. <laughs> We better get something to clean it up. <laughs> Maybe a protective suit with a gas mask. <laughs> um, Layla, you uh, uh, keep an eye on him. No thanks. Chalmers, fostering consultant and child care expert. Do sit down. Oh, please. I'm sure I'll be able to tailor make a fostering solution to suit your individual requirements. Thank you. That's very kind, Miss Chalmers. We'd really like some more information on fostering. Of course. Coming right up. You're such a creep. The unfortunate truth is, some kids aren't suitable for fostering. They can't even get on with their own parents let alone anyone else. We couldn't stand the smell. Oh, come on, we better find him. <clears throat> Good afternoon. My name's Rio. Hello, Rio. You look smart. Thank you. I like to look clean and tidy. I'm a quiet boy on the whole, but I've got a very good sense of humour. He has. He's hilarious. I'm his sister, Roxy. Uh, uh, and I really enjoy family outings. My hobbies are... Cooking. Have a biscuit. We made them. <laughs> They make you fat. You can't have them. I I'll get you some nice ones. That's all right, Rio, dear. We're not hungry. <laughs> and, uh, do you live here too? Not for long. I'm planning to touch the place. <laughs> Finale, let's check him out, don't be careful. Well, take it then. They were nice. They could have been our chance to get out of here. They were nice. Oh, stop whining. Rio? I've had enough of you. You ruined everything for me. Piggy, 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 come on, pig. Oh, West Ham, come on. Come on, pig. We found him. I'm puffed out. Dragon, we should just give up and put him back in his pen. Don't worry, I got a plan.
sorry. It's just... People like you. They just don't like me. And I don't like them. No one's ever going to fuss to me, are they? Couldn't bear it if we got split up. It's bad enough for Chantal gone. I miss her too. I'd really like a family, Roxy. But I'd never leave you without you. Because you were then, the chappy likes our first. Lady, are you sure about this? You know, who took the ball? Hello, Elaine Boyack, social worker and head care worker. Hello! Helen, not going so soon, are you? I've got some leaflets. Uh, perhaps you'd like a guided tour. We're quite all right, thank uh, you. I'm, I'm, I'm sure this little one would love a brother or sister. Thinking. We didn't like seeing West Ham cooped up. It's cruel. And chickens have feelings too. You're right. And they're probably nervous wrecks by now. A bit like a lane. <laughs> you lot are dangerous individuals, and these animals need protecting. So first thing tomorrow morning, they're all going back to the farm. For a bit of peace and quiet. Which is just what we need. Come on, up you get. Oh. Tracy? What are you doing here? Ask them! That one's chucking me out! For the last time, I'm not chucking you out! I know, but I'm not wanted! Tracy, calm Silly. Look, I am calm. And this cam is being silly, moving over monkey face. Oi! Well, if he's moving in, I am moving out. Tracy, look, please don't be like this. I love you. I just want you to come home. Honest. So, looks like you won't get your own set of keys after all. Didn't you hear? She wants me, so you better just go. Tracy, I never said that. I want you both in my life. Do you know what? Forget it. Have your stupid boyfriend and stay in here. Great. Just when you thought life couldn't get any worse, Beaker's back. 